Okay, so this is basically the heater. Uh, the heater. Uh, of course, this is your thermal pile or the pilot generator. And you could see that the pilot would stay lit. The pilot on its own would stay lit. So that means that that thermal pile or the pilot generator is still good. Uh, and it was actually generating some electricity uh, from the meter. And so that indicates to me this valve is bad. What had happened was it would initially light and fire up once after it rests for about an hour. But then it would, it would not fire up again after the initial fire up. So that indicates to me the valve is bad. If your thermal pile is good, your pilot generator is generating electricity and your valve is not working uh, accordingly. So if your pilot generator is keeping your, uh, your pilot on and you're having some other problem with the, the final ignition coming out of here, uh, then you need a new valve. Now this, this particular valve, this is of course the replacement valve. This is the required replacement valve for this one. And you can see that this is the inlet. It's marked right on it, inlet. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this one in place of this old one here. And these, these, these are not rebuildable in my world. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's not a good idea to try and mess with these unless you're quite experienced, but I wouldn't recommend it. So I'm just going to replace it with a new valve. And you can see that this is where the... This is where the pilot uh, tube goes. And the pilot tube is on the back of this one, on the back here. The pilot tube entrance is on the front of this one. So what I had to do is I had to buy this kit, which is, uh, you may not have to buy it if you're able to reroute this accordingly. But basically, we'll, we'll take a uh, tube cutter and cut approximate length from here to here. And um, and put it together that way. So that would okay. So uh, it's gonna look something like this one. I had to get a new uh, a new feed line. This one here, it just would not turn when I tried to turn. The only thing it would only turn in one uh, one piece. So I uh, kind of boogered that up in there and uh, tried to get another one of those. So that's what's gonna look like something like that. And uh, so they have these different. Uh, this, I had to put the sleeve on for this one here, and they have the plugs you have to put in here too. Um, so yeah, that's all I need to do, except now I just need to figure out how to get this, the pilot, uh, uh, this pilot tube in there. I think I may be able to use this one, I'm not sure, but I'll probably have to use this kit that I got to make a new one. Thanks again for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Solve this problem. Thanks for watching. If you need any help, I give phone consultations for $25. You can call me 707-443-8347 Pacific Time, 9 to 6.